Welcome to Colorado Springs, the second largest city in the state of Colorado. This place is known for its wildlife, outdoor activities, and of course, its gorgeous scenery. But why is it nicknamed the City of Millionaires? Well, back in the late 1890s, gold was found on Pikes Peak. It inspired over 50,000 people to flood the area in an effort to strike it rich. Did you know that this was the scenery that inspired Kathleen Lee Bates when she wrote America the Beautiful? Bates spent a summer lecturing at Colorado College. When she references Purple Mountain Majesties, she's talking about the view from here at Garden of the Gods, as well as the summit of Pikes Peak, the highest point on the Southern Front Range of the Rocky Mountains. Somewhere in these mountains is a site for sore eyes. As far back as the early 1800s, rumors started flying around about a massive ape-like creature with reports of a human-like face. Nicknamed Bigfoot and also referred to as Sasquatch, locals say that they have seen him here along the Pikes Peak Highway. In 1999, they even installed a Bigfoot crossing sign to ensure public safety. As long as we're talking about the legend of Colorado Springs, since it was founded in 1871, the city was built as a premium healthcare destination for individuals with tuberculosis. The combination of sunshine, therapeutic scenery, and fresh air encouraged a large number of individuals battling the disease to move here. One of those visitors was a woman named Emma Crawford who was known for her musical talents. In 1889, she moved from the West Coast to Manitou Springs, hoping to heal her tuberculosis. One day while hiking Red Mountain, she made it known that that is where she would eventually want to be laid to rest. Her loved ones honored that. Years after her passing though, a heavy rainfall dislodged Emma's coffin from the mountain, sending it shooting down right into town. Unfortunate, sure, but it sparked an annual Halloween tradition. Each year, the Emma Crawford coffin races take place on Manitou Avenue. A team of four mourners push and pull coffin-like contraptions. Awards are also handed out to the best Emma and the most creative coffin. Go figure, legend says that the ghost of Emma Crawford still haunts Red Mountain to this day.